first of all uh, welcome in my channel and uh, today i'm going to tell you about my membership plan first of all uh, i will provide you dotnet core video tutorial dapper tutorial rest rest api tutorial angular uh, angular video tutorial and uh, not only video tutorial i will uh, provide you complete source code okay and it's not only a simple video tutorial it's a project based video tutorial so each technology have minimum two projects so guys this is a project based courses in all technologies just 800 rupees and you focus that it's not only a technology it's a roadmap okay so that is the complete roadmap of dotnet core and that video tutorial is providing you a past deal for you okay so first of all i will provide you dotnet core and uh, video tutorial it's not only based uh, it's not only simple video tutorial again i repeat you a uh, project based video tutorial so i will cover it uh, all design patterns and uh, solid patterns and uh, architectural designs okay so uh, i will give you uh, clean architecture based projects okay so uh, that is dotnet core and uh, that dotnet core used entity framework core and sql server in further video i will use adio.net and the dapper and uh, just after that i will use blazor for as a front end and angular as a front end and the react as a front end uh, so use rest api so it's a based on project uh, okay and it's a road map so that we can cover all the topics of the full stack development so this is only 800 rupees i will uh, you will uh, you just pay me 800 rupees and get all video tutorials okay so uh, day by day and uh, if you are belong from other country just pay a dollar 15 and it's only a one time fees that is again i repeat you one time fees just only pay 800 rupees and get the source code and complete video tutorials okay so how to get the deal just fill this form that is your name your email id your contact number contact number is not necessary transaction reference id order id or paypal id if you are belong from india just pay using upi id and uh, just add your transaction reference id uh, and after that uh, if you are belong from other country just use this my uh, paypal id and this is you can use this qr code also okay and submit the form after submit your form you will get a notification uh, via email and uh, start your journey for the membership okay so uh, just find the link of this form in your video description box so must to check your video description box okay uh, hurry up guys because it's a limited time deal hey everyone welcome to my channel asp.core and today i am going to fix this angular problem and angular problem occurs in standalone application when you click the categories nothing happen uh, when uh, when you click and nothing uh, you know uh, have a compile time error okay so how to resolve this types of problem if your uh, routing is not working so just go for these uh, component the first component is app component dot html file and here you can see that here we have a router outlet so i want to add router outlet here uh, like that import uh, that is router outlet is already there in the uh, angular uh, at the rate angular slash router so i want to add a router here because everything is including in the routing so that is the router so you know a router is, and the router outlet is there so just i want to add router here so router uh, okay so add a router module so add a router module here so uh, you know that that is the dependency router module is necessary to add in the app component.ts file so app component.ts have a router outlet so that we can add router uh, module and router outlet module in app component.ts file also you know that here we have uh, a, uh, here we have a menu that is the menu and the menu is also contain a router link so you can see that that is the menu map toolbar color primary and that is the router link you can see that that is the router link and also uh, that is the router link is here with the categories okay so uh, must to configure your routes with this uh, by using the routing uh, configuration 
So here we have a path is categories and component is index category component, but it's not rendered because component dot uh, component dot html dot uh, component menu dot component dot html have a router link, but menu dot component dot ts do not have any uh, router uh, component. Okay, so import uh, router module. Okay, so router module is must to add here and that is the standalone application so you have to add this is router module okay now after doing this you can see you uh, your application will work fine so when we click to category it uh, move, uh, move navigate properly okay so thank you guys for watching this video and keep watching all other videos which is related to asp.net code and angular thank you very much for watching